Here is one thing you need to let go of to have your best relationship. All right, welcome to Relationship Tuesday. Today I'm going to talk about one thing you need to let go of to have your best relationship, and that is control, okay? Your control issues have probably made you very successful. You've probably got your stuff together. Uh, but one thing that we can't control, well, there are lots of things we can't control, but being in love with somebody and really surrendering to the experience of sharing your life with somebody requires a release of control. You don't know what's going to happen. To surrender and to, you know, just open yourself up to any kind of possibility that this person might, you know, leave unexpectedly, might break your heart, might die. You know, it requires a big surrendering of control for you to fully embrace that relationship and to fully be involved. Okay. I have an interesting fact that might be helpful. There have been studies that show when people have healthy and secure relationships, they actually do better after the partner has passed away than those who are in less secure and less intense, deep, connected relationships. So it really is better to have loved and lost than not to have loved at all, says the quote. And to let go of your control issues is really important for you to really surrender into the kind of love that you deserve and that you desire if you don't have it yet. So I hope that's helpful. Let go of your control issues. Easier said than done for a lot of us. <laughs> but at the end of the day, we really don't have control and so to surrender is to trust that, you know, we're taken care of and everything's going to be okay. Um, easier said than done sometimes, but I hope you can practice. All right. Thank you as always for watching and I will talk to you next week. Bye.